two captains leading out their nations, the hopes of their nations resting on their shoulders. France get the final underway. As with a lot of finals, caution plays a big part in the opening stages, but an early goal can blow all that away, so I hope that we can um, create a, a, an attacking contest here, which, which obviously we want for this showpiece. He can get that clear. Nyingalan. Azar. Fellaini. Nyingalan. Now it's Benteke. Benteke looks to dink one in. Whistle's gone, that for offside? Yes, it is. They may have been caught offside, but they aren't going to give up on that type of run. They only need to get it right once, and it's all about the timing now. Matuidi. Griezmann. France, get it back again. Benzema. He's gone for goal! Well, with this guy and the talent he's got, you know he's probably going to try his look from there, but that one he didn't really get right at all. Well, I think the early signs have been very good for them. They've already got that defence unsettled, and now they've got to back it up. Lacazette with the ball through. Ball has crossed the line and it's a throw. So what now? now it's Lacazette. Lacazette. There are a few waiting for it. Turns and goes back. Azar. No goals as yet. Tries a through ball. Hazard. Benteke. Nyingalan. This could fall anywhere. Kabai pumps it forwards. He's made sure that that won't get through. And it's Azar. Azar. England. Now it's Benteke. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Aimed long and direct. For Tongan, gets good distance on it. Latrini. It's Benzema! That was mighty close. But that's exactly the sort of stuff you want to see in the final. That would have been some goal if it was on target. Nyingalan still waiting for the first goal. Nyingalan with a delicate ball. Here it comes. Nyingalan needed to come up with a better ball. Look, if he wants that ball to make it, then he has to pass it with a bit more zip. I think he knew as soon as it left his boot, it was going to be cut out. Just lacked a little more power. Now here's the through ball. Evra, very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. Griezmann. And it's Evra. Now it's Lacazette. Pogba. Has a look and has a go. Good first touch and almost as good a second. But that's exact. Whistle's gone and we've reached the halfway point of the final. So we've had the first 45 minutes of the final, Jim. How's it looking for you?
Yeah, there's so much riding on this. It's understandable that caution and the fear of throwing it away is having the biggest influence. Uh, this game needs a moment of magic now. An engrossing half, but we're still where we started. Nil-nil. Well, that first 45 minutes didn't deliver as we'd hoped. Lots of effort, but a, a lack of quality with the finishing has left us hoping that someone can step up and produce something a little more magical. Azar. Nyingalan. And he's made certain that won't get through. Kabai. Lacazette. Matuidi. England. Still nothing to reflect upon in terms of goals here. It is nil-nil. That's a foul. Free kick's been given. Company. Mertens. Pocognoli. Looks to slip it through. Mertens. The referee's awarded a free kick. Well, the ref's been lenient here. Well, I doubt he'll get too many more chances. on it nil nil the score and we're just about done a deeply frustrating game Mamadou Sako Kabai boots it upfield De Bruyne all the way back and they start again Koscielny. France haven't made a substitution yet. Kabai. Benzema. There's a look to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. Has he found his man? Oh, good interception. Now the pass. Fellaini. Unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Koscielny. Passes it through. I needed a better pass there to the keeper and try something new. Gets it upfield. Mertens. Rafael Varan. Spoon forward. There's one quality pass away from being a very decent chance, but very promising. I thought it was good vision, but the execution was poor. Almost nothing left on the clock here. Extra time is imminent, unless something dramatic happens now. And it's for Tonga. Well, time is running out. They need to get the ball at field. Company positions himself well and cuts it out. The counter is on. He's away. All oh, the balls come loose. The Tweedy. And he's whipped it in low. And in again. World class carry Benzema. Well, we're sitting here wondering who, if anyone, was going to be able to step up and find a way to go with the clock running down. And the skipper obliges. It should cement victory in what has been a pretty unpredictable affair. Courtois did well the first time, nothing he could do about the follow-up. Well, as they say, Peter, if you don't speculate, you won't accumulate. And we've just witnessed a player who was rewarded for his willingness to take a risk, as cunning as it comes. 
France take the lead. Now it's just a question of holding on. And that's it. Simply, the big day was their day. A day for them and their fans. A truly proud line in their history. France have won the cup and the time has come to collect it. It is party time.